So when you walk into my room, this is the shabby chic wonderland that you walk into. It's so gorgeous. I love the final result of this. Look how pretty you guys. This is like a transformation. Super Love Shack fancy inspired. So let's begin the room tour. So right on over here, I have my clothing rack and I actually got that from the trash. Believe it or not, it was free. It's so cute. And then I went ahead and I put this beautiful garland from Michaels and that was also on sale. So I didn't buy it full price. And I just love how this came out. These are little knickknacks that I got for free from my brother's fiance. And they're super pretty and vintage and so shabby chic cottage core love shack fancy inspired. So moving on down here, I just have my vintage lamb planter. I thought it looked very shabby chic, but it, I also want to keep the vintage aesthetic in the room as well. As well as this little poetry like ceramic book. It says thinking of you and it's just super pretty. One of my subscribers and lovely friends gave this to me. Her name is Mercedes and she was so nice to do that. It's just so vintage and romantic. And then behind there I just have a little macaron. I don't know it's a I don't know if it's a macaron or a macaroon but I'm just gonna call it a macaron. And then down here, I just have this vintage bowl that I got from the thrift store, as well as this little Dollar Tree lantern and a little Dollar Tree floral arrangement. So right on down here, I just have this wicker basket that I got from the thrift store, and I just tied this little lace bow around from the Dollar Tree, and then I have another flower floral arrangement down here as well. So this shelf, I actually Mod Podge some wrapping paper on here and I got the shelf from the trash as well, but it looks super shabby chic and Love Shack fancy inspired, which I love. So I do want to swap out these hangers for more shabby chic ones, but these will do for now. This, these are just all my Love Shack fancy Target dresses mixed with floral dresses and my Victoria's Secret robe as well. And I think it looks really, really pretty on this clothing rack, which I got from the trash. And it just looks so romantic and shabby chic. So right up here, I just have this bird cage that I got from Michaels a while ago. I'm not sure what I really wanna put in it. I did have the floral garland in there at one point, but I do need to find something else to put in. Maybe I'll put in a pair of shoes. And then right on down here, I just have my Madden Girl shabby chic heels, and I love those so much. Right on down here, I have a pastel ceramic house that I got from the thrift store, as well as some more Madden Girl heels. They're so Love Shack Fancy inspired. I can't get over this print. And then the last thing on this shelf, and the shelf I actually got from the trash as well, believe it or not. And this is the last thing, and this is just a ceramic pastel house that I got with the other. I got quite a few of those from the thrift store. So this is my closet door and I just have this wreath hung up and I have one of those clear wreath hangers to hang that up and it looks super pretty. And then right on over here, I have my vintage mirror. I love this so much. My mom actually gifted this to me. And then this is just like an overview of everything and I'll kind of go into more depth once I get closer. So right on over here, I just have this gorgeous, shabby, chic, ornate bow picture frame that I got from Marshalls. And I have this little candle holder and it's super shabby chic. It was only a dollar at the thrift store. And I just love this so much. This is one of the best things I've ever thrifted that's shabby chic. And then I have a little lantern I made from Dollar Tree as well as a Dollar Tree candle holder that is holding that little candle holder. And then down here, I just have a pillowcase. I thought I would add a nice romantic shabby chic touch to the vanity. And then right on over here, I just have my crown. This is so beautiful, you guys. Let me give you a closer look. So gorgeous. And right on over here, I just have another vintage candle holder that I got from the thrift store as well as the Dollar Tree one underneath. And then this right here is just so gorgeous. I don't even know what it is. It's like a spindle of some kind and somebody made it. It's super shabby chic and pretty and it just couldn't get any better than this. I thrifted this last week and I just think it's super pretty and so Love Shack Fancy inspired. 
as well as this jar, you guys. Somebody actually made this, and I kind of am inspired to make stuff like this. Like, look at the top of this jar. I don't know what I'm going to put in it, but it's so, so pretty, and it just reminds me of a fairy tale. And then right on over here, I just have my breakfast at Chanel sign, as well as this Rachel Ashwell lampshade and it's super pretty and then the lamp base is actually from when I was a child and I don't know exactly where it's from I think it was from Marshall's a long time ago but there is no brand on the bottom because I would give you a brand but honestly I don't know I'm sorry guys but it's so pretty and I will never ever get rid of this I just love it so much so guys I finally got my love shack fancy inspired curtains I just typed in swag bow curtains and this is just a little overview it's kind of getting getting a little dark so now that I get to the bottom, the light's peeking in. The garland is actually from my friend Mercedes as well. She gave me a bunch of stuff. And I don't know if I'm going to post this video before or after, but I don't know when I'm going to share what she gave to me, but it's super pretty anyways. Um, I just have my skincare fridge, and then I just have some pillows, and this is just my pink storage bench. And I just keep a bunch of blankets in there as well as DVDs and whatnot. In here, I am planning on filling up all these pink skincare bottles, and I have a skin care, like makeup eraser wipe here. So yeah, I'm going to get to that. So moving on over here, this is just a little overview of my bed situation I have going on. I did make that bow and I literally just glued it together. I do want to learn how to sew so I can sew them and make them for my shop because that would be such a delight to actually bring that kind of stuff to you because I know Love Shack Fancy doesn't actually sell them yet. I did ask them and they said they would get back to me in an email, but I'm not sure if they did or not. I don't believe so. But um, yes, these are all my shabby chic pillows and my bedspread is reversible. It's the one from Walmart. Um, I believe it is still sold out, but people are reselling them. So I'm sure you could find it online. And then right on up over here, I just have my pink Rosaline swirl glasses and they're vintage. They're super pretty and super aesthetic. And then up here, I just have a little Love Shack Fancy DIY project that I did from the Dollar Tree. So this is actually one of my favorite corners. I made a little skincare lounge type area perfumery and I got this shelf from the thrift store. I got it from Savers. It's super pretty with the heart cutouts. And I just put all of my Ariana Grande perfumes, my moisturizer from Truly Organic, and then I put some perfumes and an eye mask on it and it looks super shabby chic and vintage and just everything. And this picture frame is just so gorgeous. It was my mom's and she gave it to me. And then I have a vintage hat over here. And then right up on over here, this is my other window with my beautiful curtains. I love them so, so much. Um, I'm not sure if there was a brand on here or not. I don't believe so. Um, and it says, and they all lived happily ever after. And that's from the thrift store. I just thought it tied in really nicely with the shabby chic theme. And then right on over here, I have these bows that Mercedes also gave to me. Thank you so much again. And then I have some vintage mirrors and a wall sconce. And then I have my mannequin down here with my Love Shack Fancy Target dress on here. And I can always swap it out for other Love Shack Fancy Target dresses because I don't actually own any Love Shack Fancy dresses, but I do have, you know, other shabby chic dresses in general. But so over in this corner, I just have my home little picture frame if you want to call it. I do sell these in my shop. If you're interested, I will link it down below. Right on down here, I just keep my Victoria's Secret pom-pom slippers. Okay, so this corner is really, really cute, but the only thing is the bottom of it is just totally all wires from my computer and my camera and my Cricut and my sewing machine. So I'm not going to show you down below, but this is just the little shelf area and how I decorated it. And I got this like planter wire shelf rack. I don't even know what it is. And it has wheels at the bottom, but I got this from the thrift store a while ago for like literally $5 and it was the best $5 like I've ever spent. Like honestly, super cute and so aesthetic. 
I am working on hiding the wires. So I did get these baskets from the Christmas tree shop. And then I put my Rolo printer, like my label printer in here. And then I put this like little DIY project that I made from Dollar Tree and some fabric onto the top. And it's just so shabby chic and cute. And it kind of hides like the little sticker underneath here because I couldn't get it off. Um, and then this is my actual vanity. This this is like my drawer. I just keep some makeup brushes in there. It says she lived happily ever after. I have my keyboard in here, which is really handy and I can always take it out and put it on top if I wanted to. And then right on over here, sorry, I have to like move my ring light everywhere I go. So right on over here, I just have this candle lit. I, I just got this candle from the Christmas tree shops. It is strawberry shortcake. And then I have this little, you know, poof thing. What is this called? Like a makeup poof? I don't even know what it's called, but yeah, I got this. And then I have this little ceramic container. You can put anything in it, but I just decided to put it in here. It looks so shabby chic and cute, you guys. And then right on over here, I just have this little box. You can always keep storage in there if you wanted to. I just keep all my nail stuff in there. And then I have these perfumes over here. And, um, and then in here is just all my makeup palettes. I do have more. And then I have my beautiful mess perfume, my Hello Kitty Compact Mirror. And I do want to paint this pink as well because I saw somebody do that online. I thought it was really cute. So I do need to pick up some spray paint. And then right next to my computer, I just have this little, I don't know what this is. It's just like a frame with a hook on it and it goes onto the wall. It's so pretty. I got it at the Home Sense store. And then I just have this pearl hanger with one of my Love Shack fancy Target dresses. And it's so pretty. I love this so much. It just completes the whole room and the whole Love Shack fancy vibe.